Hey guys, what's up? This is Nine Live Software, and today I'll be showing you guys how to change the font, background color, and change the size of the font for on, on UI labels. So go to new Xcode file, new project, view based application. Let's call this change all. Okay, maximize the window. Go to our classes and go to the view control H. After the first clear background, do enter ID outlet space UI view space star background view semicolon and then enter ID outlet space UI label space star label color semicolon and you need to after the second color back a dash ID action change font semicolon enter dash IV action change back for background now go to the dot m file and do dash IV action change font um, and then in between here we're going to do UI font space star cool font space equal space square bracket UI font space font with name at parenthesis and then the font you want. I'm just going to do Arial parenthesis size and that's how big you want it. So I'm going to do 18.0 square bracket semicolon enter label color dot font space equal space cool font semicolon and then dash IB action change back and then we're going to do I forgot what I named it background view okay so we're going to do background view dot background color space equal space square bracket UI color space black or sorry I also do blue color square back square bracket semicolon oh and also in between here we're going to do square bracket Oh, no, no square bracket, sorry. Label color dot text color space equals space square bracket UI color space red color square bracket semicolon and then now go to resources, go to view control dot nib tools library drag in a label drag in two buttons And lastly, we need to drag. Actually, no, no, that's it. So let's put them in the middle. Go to Files Owner. Second tab in, in the Inspector. Background View to the View. Label Color to Label. Change Back to one of the buttons, touch up inside. Change Font to the other button, touch up inside. Let's mm. name these. Ready. Background and the Font. Okay, so go to Xcode, build and go. And we should have zero errors and zero warnings. So change the background, change to blue, change the font, change to red. Okay, and also, so you can see a difference, I'm going to do. 40 and I'm just going to do times new Roman. So change the background, change the font. There it goes. And so that is how you change the font color. And, um, background color and size. So thanks guys for watching and please subscribe.